Welcome to the video guys, today I'm going to follow my old high school bodybuilding diet. When I was in high school, I was a skinny kid trying to build some muscle because, well, I saw all of these massive people online with all those muscles and I was like, I want to be like that. I was trying to build some muscle, but I didn't really know what I was doing at that time. So yeah, I was lifting some weights, but my diet, well, the diet was the best that you can follow to build muscle. So today should be really interesting. Let's get to the video. So every morning before school, of course, I had to get some protein in because protein was life. And without protein, you can't build muscle. So that's why I had six whole eggs in the morning. I know six whole eggs is a lot, but hey, as I said, I didn't really know what I was doing. I was just following the things that I saw online. I saw all these massive bodybuilders eat tons of eggs and not even eating it. I saw some of the people just drink it straight away. So I prefer to cook it. So yeah, six whole eggs, a little bit of spray. Put it on the bread, like that. Done. So every single morning I was just sitting on the couch with my breakfast and of course some ketchup. Can't miss the ketchup, you know. Watching some TV before school. It's kind of messy, but hey. That's how my life was when I was a kid, so... You know what I really like? Is that from the beginning, I kept it really simple. I just did what worked for me and what I enjoyed. And I still do that. So I guess that's a good thing, right? The funny thing is that even today, I still eat eggs every single day because I just like eggs. I just like it because it's super simple to make and it's also tasty if you use the right seasonings and 7 kilos of ketchup on top of it. During my lunch break at school, I would go to the grocery store and pick up some more bread with some chicken filet and of course a protein bar for some extra protein because you just can't have enough protein, you know? And why I didn't eat the food at school is because one, it wasn't really that good and two, it was expensive. So that's why I went to the grocery store and did it my way. Just open it up like this, grab half of this package chicken filet <laughs> look look how big this stack is man there's like maybe 50 grams of protein in all of this so hey I'm not complaining close it up and then eat it like this you know it's so simple it's cheap and it does the job that's what you need made a complete mess of myself this one and this protein bar mm. so this one has 20 grams of protein in it it's also plant-based so that's pretty good and of course I had to go with brown bread because at that time white bread was bad for you and made you fat All right, so that is done. Now we're getting to the good stuff. This one is peanut butter chocolate flavor. Mm. This one is so good. You know what I really like these days? It's they make these protein bars so good 
that it doesn't even taste like a protein bar. It just tastes like some kind of Snickers, chocolate bar or you name it, you know. It's that good. It's also addicting. So don't get a full box of protein bars because I will guarantee you, you will finish it in one day. Yeah. So after school, I would go home and make a big bowl of food. So what I got here is, I guess it was 250 grams of chicken, uncooked. Now I'm gonna prepare this package of jasmine rice and some Mexican vegetables because I was lazy and this was probably the closest thing to vegetables that I would eat in a day. So this meal is pretty big with a lot of calories, a lot of carbs and some protein, but it's also gonna be my pre-workout meal. So that's why we need the calories. So that is done, turn off the heat, throw in the chicken and then put it in a bowl. So now the only thing that's missing is some chili sauce. This one is without any added sugar. When I went to high school and tried to build muscle, I wouldn't even care about the added sugar, but now I do. So yeah, that's why I use this one. pre workout meal, as I said, it's a big one with a lot of calories, but we need them for the pump. And also just use as much chili sauce as you want because everything is just better with a lot of sauce. You just can't have enough sauce, you know. Everything is better when it's wet. And again, that's just a meal that is so quick to make and also easy to make. It took me like five to eight minutes to cook up the chicken and warm up the rice and the veggies. So easy to make, doesn't take a lot of time. And it's also pretty tasty. Well, it's better if you use the chili sauce because otherwise it's a bit bland. But hey, I didn't even care. I just needed to get the calories in and the protein. Done. And I'm curious, let me know. Do you eat your rice with a fork or a spoon? Because I always use a fork. But I know some people that always use a spoon. So comment down below, which one are you? Finish it off with some orange juice. That was the meal, pre-workout meal. Now I'm gonna wait for maybe an hour, an hour and a half, then hit the gym. Had a good workout and after the gym I might go to Subway, get a nice sandwich with a lot of protein. It's also not too bad, but hey, I don't care, it's good and we need the calories.
back from the gym it was a solid session now it's time for some food as I said before I went to Subway and I got a chicken sandwich with a lot of vegetables and they always make a mess check out this look it's still pretty good though Mm. Oh yeah, especially with the pickles, they eat so much better. So I got a chicken sandwich without the cheese, I can't handle the cheese so that's why I skip on it. I went for the hot chili sauce and all the vegetables of course. Man, this is so good. So I'm gonna eat this and then Go home, relax for a couple of hours. Go home, relax for a couple of hours, and then maybe have another bad time. Man, shut up. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna eat this. Relax for. I'm gonna kill that bird. I'll see you guys. First I'm gonna kill the bird, then I'm gonna go home. I'll see you guys there. All right, just got back home from the movies. As you can see, I'm still dressed, got some jeans on and regular shirt. Now it's time for the last meal of the day. Well, meal slash snack. This is what I would have in my high school bodybuilding diet as my last meal. So what I have here is some Greek yogurt mixed in with one scoop of protein and some banana chunks and of course some Cheetos. So every night I was just sitting, snacking on some Cheetos and getting some more protein in because well, you just can't have enough protein, you know? The more protein you eat, the more muscle you're gonna build. Not just kidding, that's what I thought at least in my first years of bodybuilding but hey now I know better so don't judge me all right so I'm gonna eat these finish this bowl massive bowl of protein oh and if you want to check out the protein that I use for this one it's a vegan one from Inosubs link is in the description use my code that is on the screen right now and yeah that is it and that is gonna wrap up this video guys. I hope you liked it. It was pretty fun to do. It was also pretty enjoyable because it was so simple and the meals were pretty good. But yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. If you liked the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, follow me on Instagram, and I'll see you guys in the next one.